Dig, you good over there, bro? I don't know, man. What you doing up there, buddy? A ratchet strapping this nonsense to the floor. Hey, where we headed, Matt? Mount Katahdin, Baxter State Park, Maine. Baxter State Park, we are climbing Mount Katahdin, the end of the Appalachian. We're rigging up the car, and then it's time to head off to Maine. Let's get it. It was now time to hit the road. For the longest time, I've been wanting to hike Mount Katahdin. Ever since I heard about people hiking from Georgia to Maine on the Appalachian, I've been wanting to go to Baxter State Park. It was a ten and a half hour drive all the way from Central Jersey, but we had a lot of laughs on the way. Eventually, we ended up in Baxter State Park. We hit the border, and we were almost there. We stared our eyes down at the mountain above, and really enjoyed as we took pictures on the drive. Let everybody know, what's up? It smells so good out it here. Smells good out here. Why? Well, what about it, bro? Let us know. This smells crisp. Zig forgot to um, print out the reservations. Zig. <laughs> <laughs> we finally made it to the campground. We are at Troutbrook Campground, site number 17. And it's pretty dope. This dude shot throwing a hat at me. <laughs> oh shit, my bad. So uh, the weather report was for rain tomorrow. Freaking look at this pavilion. Welcome to town hall. <laughs> we got a community senator. senator. <laughs> this um, this is what I call um, a really good knot. <laughs> That's probably where we're supposed to check in. We are currently off to the water, the agua. Squid, squid. Current situation with this lip. Look at this lip, bro. What the f man? Luckily, I got Benadryl. Like giving you the things you asked for, and I know I was wrong. It's what I try to tell you with a song. Tell you with a song. What if I said I'm sorry? What if I'd make a scene? Wouldn't that make you mine again? You're all I'll ever need. Didn't I make you laugh? Didn't I make you smile? Didn't I make you feel like you were happy for? Good morning, everybody. 7:30 a.m. Woke up nice and early. Ziggy just got up too. It's time to start day two, guys. Getting some ramen going. Some breakfast. And we'll be out. Let's get it. Is it recording? Yeah, I see the dot. You see the dot? Huh? Is it recording? I think the dots are. Is it recording? It's like dipping dots. What the f is Martin? <laughs> Yo, Martin, you good? This is this is Ben. Tropic Mountain, starting it. Got the squad back there stretching. They hurting already. There's no way we're making up Katata. <laughs> Let's get it. All right, boys. Freaking made it. Welcome to the top. Trout Summit. The Trout Brook Mountain Summit. Mountain. All right, guys. We're gonna take a quick break, snack a little bit, refuel, and then we back down this mountain. It's times like this where time becomes non-existent. It's for that fragment and moment of time. But time just stops. We're so far up north, I think it's time to really just appreciate the present time. It's beautiful up here, guys. Mm. 
currently at the canoe rental. Picking up some paddles so we can go canoe in the water. Oh, Brian, what happened, bro? I fell in. Brian! <laughs> oh my oh, god. Currently making our way downstream over to the lake. <laughs> this water's way too shallow here. I've never had such a more raw feeling than this right now. Pouring rain in a canoe, off grid. Let's check out this scenery. I'm using my phone right now, but look at this. Got Ziggy's on the paddle up front. Got the kids showing the back. It's crazy. This is unbelievable. I urge you guys head out to Baxter State Park, go all the way north almost in Canada, and just experience this for yourself. The water's low right now too, so this is, will be crazier. It was now at this moment where it felt so real. Paddling out to the back country with drizzling rain and just enjoying nature at its finest. That's absolutely insane. We just landed ashore, and this is where we ended up. Check this. Well, we're on an island right now. We just paddled out like three miles. Check out this island, guys. Holy crap. You know those celebrities always take pictures like Three miles later, we ended up here. We had some downtime, so I fished. And luckily, I had a little bit of success. The others explored, and we just enjoyed our time here. Third fish of the day. Got another little small mouth. All right, let's move back. Last few seconds here on this island. Caught a bunch of mussels and some little baby fish, but we headed back now. I am sorry for the wind, but look how beautiful this scenery is. It is absolutely amazing. Never been on an island like this ever. Let's get out of here, get back to camp, cook up some dinner. Could in two days, two days. One of the most amazing parts is we're truly in the middle of nowhere. About a hundred miles away from the closest town, and we haven't seen a soul in a while. This was the true backcountry. Yo, my man is freaking so weird. It's so deep with mud. Dude, you're gonna die, <laughs> bro. Stop. The only option. I don't think I'm gonna rescue you either. <laughs> nah, it's Yo, my man really just swam. This man swam all the way here because we are currently stuck oh. <laughs> in this sand pile in this beauty. Brian's our freaking Jesus hero. Christ. Brian is the hero. The hero is here! Yes. Woo! Yo! Brian! <laughs> I cannot believe you just did that, bro. That's crazy. Remember, all this is being documented. Crazy. Look at this. This is amazing. Almost free. Martin has lost his shoe about 30 minutes ago. <laughs> we have about 30 minutes of sunlight. We have to trek back maybe another mile and a half. Mom, I love you if I die here. I'm just kidding. Let's get back to camp. Let's get back to camp. Problem number two, Martin has a leech. When in need, you have to call Brian. Martin, you good? Yeah. Burn, see that shit? Oh, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Don't burn your foot, bro. I feel like it's mad hot right now. Probably horse right now. Oh, like look, he came off, right? Is that? He, just I think come he did come off. Yeah. Oh, oh shit. Fire, See, he did die. He died. Throw him in the fire. fire. Tomorrow we head out to the next campsite in Katahdin Stream. We're leaving Troutbrook. We're summoning Katahdin the next day. So I'm going to catch you guys probably in the morning tomorrow because there's no need to record. But for now, let's get some food going. What's up, everybody? It is day three. Tomorrow we climb Katahdin. Today is a chill day. Last night, it was muggy and hot. All right, let's get ready, let's pack up, make some breakfast, let's go. It takes a certain person to do it on their own. Yeah, they're really good. I only ever had, I had like one pair of wolves. Getting right? Bro, you gave me some. You getting ready for Katahdin? Opening up my airways. I'm gonna fly to the top of Katahdin.
Wild wow, blueberries, man. Oh, that's perfect. Mmm. This man behind the camera, his new name is Gadget. Because he got them gadgets. He's got the gadget in his hand right now. He's got the gadget on his wrist. He's got the gadget in his backpack. This man's name is Gadget. And what's your trail name, Sam? <laughs> I don't know, what's my trail name? <laughs> we haven't assigned him a trail name yet, but you know what we do know? <laughs> <laughs> Ox! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I got a good one from Martin! Oh, no. One foot! <laughs> okay, great value! Great value, <laughs> we out! This is, this is the fountain of youth. Everyone's going crazy over running water. I feel great. Clean. We are off to Katana Stream down south. But there was one stop beforehand. Millinocket, Maine. Yo, what is this thing? You don't need that. Welcome to Millinocket, Maine. This is the pre-destination before the destination. We're gonna have a beer, and then we're gonna go up a mountain. Oh boy, finally it's time for some real food. We stopped in Millinock, Maine, Maine grabbed some pizza, bean, coffee. some gift shops on the way, and we got prepared like for the right? next day we would climb Mount Katahdin. There was the beast. We stared down on the road all the way to Katahdin Stream. We knew tomorrow would be the day. Okay, everybody, we had to pop out the car for just five minutes. Yo, Maddie, what's behind us, bro? Hold up, let me adjust the camera. What is that shadow in the back? We're gonna be up there. We're gonna tomorrow. be up there tomorrow, boys. At the top of the mountain. Let's take some pictures. Let's see right there. Let's see right there. there. We that out. Monster, that beast. We that out. I'll take you down. We going down, Get baby. Right back, camp Kirkland. We are here. Katahdin Summit is tomorrow. We are setting up camp. Official sponsor of uh, Chick Fil A. Exactly. <laughs> Chick Fil A. Thank you for the breakfast this morning. I really appreciate it. If you guys could send more down to our campsite at Katahdin Stream, site number 25, that'd be awesome. So we'll see you guys later. Welcome to the campsite, nice and cozy. God damn, we are way too close. The hoarder camp, yo, what the <laughs> hell? Jesus Christ. Tying down for the storm tonight. That'll do. I don't know how this battery's even close to be dying. Dude. You know, I tripped on your Dude, put it back. Your... Man's got put booby traps everywhere. Put it back. Friggin put friggin it back. Yeah, you set me up. Spin it the other way. No, stop. <laughs> <laughs> So tomorrow is trek day. We are headed out. We're gonna be waking up 4 a.m. to hike at 5. It should take us about 10 hours or so. It's gonna be a hard trek. It's only about eight miles, but the elevation gain is so intense for the short distance. So it's gonna be a tough hike. We're gonna wake up early, but for now, let's eat some Campbell's chicken noodle and go to sleep early. I'm gonna see you guys in the morning on trek day. Tomorrow's the day we conquer Mount Katahdin. The end of the Appalachian Trail, this is such a huge mountain for many people here. But so many people tomorrow will be hiking this to finish their through hike from Georgia. Congratulations to those people, but for us it's just a section hike. So let's go to sleep. I'll see you guys in the morning. Alright everybody, it's 5.30 a.m. That's it boys and girls. It is time to climb Mount Katahdin. It is time to summit and conquer this mountain. It's really early. We have coffee in our systems. Let's get it. It was now go time. It's now time to climb Mount Katahdin. It would be about eight to nine miles of the steepest terrain. Some of the steepest grades I've ever seen. But we trekked on. Out in stormy weather, I might step after step, have the we blues, climbed. But nothing ever stopped me from dusting off my shoes. You might think you'll see me falling to the ground But I threw up my umbrella Step after step, and rock after rock, down. we kept climbing One at a time, we jumped over obstacles And gave a hand when needed And sometimes we fell, but we got back up Camaraderie was the game, and we kept on going 7 o'clock a.m. Great progress. 
This is cakewalk, baby. Mile left about. Oh, I'm lying. We're almost there, got about two miles left. Video. Say hello to the YouTube fan base. Hey. What's your name? Peter Anderson from uh, Massachusetts. Massachusetts. Haven't hiked this in 30 years. 30? God bless you, sir, high five. We I made it to this nice little viewpoint right here. We are almost at the summit. And check out this beautiful view. Hey, Sean, I'm, I'm where are we? Listen, man, we're about a mile and a half from the summit. And we got this crazy view of the mountain range. Sean. I don't know if you can see it. Don't drop this camera. You can check all the way down there in the valley. Panning up. And look, there's the summit. You can't really see it. Maybe you can peek Holy it. Holy shit. Oh, there it is. Nice I got it in the shot. There it is, baby. <laughs> we out here. Try. Let's get this on the One end. Doing this one handed. <laughs> we finally broke tree line. We stared across the vista and the howling winds, and we're proud we made it this far. The views are truly incredible. It's something you honestly see in a movie. Nonetheless, we trekked on, stared across the sky enjoyed every single second as we moved on. Step after step, breath after breath, we kept on going. It was truly motivational. The through hikers all around us as they finished the through hike, we couldn't stop but smile. But it was now time. We stared across the vistas above and we trekked up to Baxter Peak. We were so close to being victorious. With our hands high, sweat pouring down our heads, we trekked along. We kept on going. We prayed to the mountain gods for a safe passing, and we looked ahead as we knew the end was near. With the winds howling 25 to 35 miles an hour, we kept on going. And then finally, we made it. Good burn, good burn. 950. Back to peak. Ah, oh, shit. You made it, yo. That's it. It's like 40 degrees up here. We're about to break some bread. Yo, all I care about right now is eating this tuna fish sandwich. <laughs> And M&M's. I'm so hungry. I'm 100% not lying to you guys. This tuna fish sandwich is like... Here they are. I see you guys. They're walking some knife's edge. Just making it happen. <laughs> They're coming back. They're done. How you guys feeling? <laughs> and that was it. We conquered Mount Katahdin. We celebrated with the other AT hikers around us, enjoyed our last few moments, and then eventually headed down. This trip was truly one of a kind, and a trip I'll always. I'll be back again. All right, can you please state your name and where are you from? It's Chief Zygopotamus. <laughs> where are you from? I hail. From Bridgewater. <laughs> I'm from Silver Spring, Maryland. The DMV. The heart of Jersey. Central Jersey, baby. <laughs> oh, I can't even see you. Oh. 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 oh my god. <laughs>
It's right? so bright. Can y'all hurry up and just ask me questions? It's like please? spaceships, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I'm tripping right there. How do you feel about the trek tomorrow and finishing the AT? I think we can do it. I think we might. I don't think all of us will come back with all of our limbs, but I'm pretty <laughs> sure we'll be all be back here by the end of the day tomorrow. I'm a little bit nervous. I think that we're going to be able to do it. I'm just, I really hope that we don't fall off of Knife's Edge. I think that'll probably be my only concern. Outside of that, ain't no thing. I don't, I don't know, man. We're about to sit on top of that mountain, staring down at all these tiny people. It's crazy how big this world is, man. We're like ants. Tomorrow's going to be the day. You're going to fall in love with mountains, guys. If you're not already. That's it. And that's what this channel's about. Falling in love with the mountains. You guys like that, right? They're crying behind camera. <laughs> Asta lasagna. See on top of the katadin, baby. Let's go.